The Zcubator promotes designers, artists and cultural producers uh, by mixing aesthetic ideas with uh, entrepreneurial practices. Two core pillars of our activities are our programs for graduates. What's Next Project is our program for projects with an entrepreneurial potential. Uh, we provide scholarships of 20,000 Swiss francs per project, uh, 12 months of support with coaching, mentoring and showcasing opportunities and access to our infrastructure. And we have uh, three projects uh, in that program per year. We are 5AM Games, an all-female Zurich-based game dev studio. Our focus lies on smart, meaningful games. We did participate in the What's Next project because for three fresh alumni it was the perfect opportunity to get insights and mentorship. If I had to describe the What's Next project in three words, for us there would be identity, guidance and inspiration. I was surprised how uh, the people from this program were passionate about our project, so thank you. Our vision for our professional future is creating a successful company as part of the Swiss games industry, and of course, creating cool games in a wholesome environment. The Zcubator started four years ago, and uh, out of the motivation to create a format that spans all the possible interpretations of entrepreneurship that exists at an art university. And we also faced the fact that a lot of our graduates become self-employed and found companies and organizations, in fact, more than at any other type of university in Switzerland. And also there are a lot of innovative ideas that uh, need support in the beginning to get off the ground. My name is Melody Chua and I am the co-founder and co-executive director of Null State. Null State has three pillars. The first is the research and development of the sensor augmented flute, which we call the chaos flute. This instrument allows us to perform live electronics performances with live visuals and live sound. The second pillar is a live electronics ensemble where the co-founder Benjamin D. Whiting and I perform with two laptops across two continents, uh, generating sound through code. The third pillar is an education pillar, which means that we give workshops and lectures on electroacoustic music composition, as well as performance with live electronics. What motivates me the most is the joy and the promise of experimentation. And it's a bit addicting actually to keep trying new things and experimenting with new technologies. I'm always curious about this field. This importance of the community and also getting the feedback from the people that you are performing for or lecturing to. You cannot just do it alone and just generate information, but you need to be sensitive to what is needed in the world and what is important for people. And that I learned a lot. The students applying for our programs come from across all disciplines at our university. They usually have a strong motivation and a strong desire to realize their own ideas and also feel the need of support in the early stages of their development. My name is Stefan Zahla. I'm the founder of the Age Lab. The Age Lab supports health and care leaders to define, develop and deliver new solutions that better support the needs and aspirations of aging communities. My motivation is to contribute to a social challenge and to improve the living conditions of vulnerable people. Before the What's Next project, I was a designer and now I consider myself as a designer and an entrepreneur. For the Age Lab, collaboration is a key aspect because no discipline can solve the challenge of the demographic aging alone. Depending on the tasks at hand, we collaborate with different partners, for example, with elderly care facilities. What's Next Studio is a studio program that enables graduates to develop an artistic practice. 
Uh, we give 12 months of support in the form of affordable studio space, coaching, mentoring, and access to our infrastructure at our campus. My name is Sibel Kocakaya Royster. I graduate from Master of Fine Arts. Start to participate in What is Next to Studio program from August. In my practice, I use interdisciplinary approach, which deals with the interconnection between artistic expression and society under the context of space. And I use different mediums, such as painting, video, photography, installation, and performance. During my participation in the studio, uh, my photography works has been a little bit changed because I start to make uh, white lines on the photographs, which is taken by analog camera. This is like a visual perception and I include when I look at the photographs. My wish for our students and graduates for the future is that they continue to realize their ideas and make an impact and do that in a way that is sustainable financially but also personally for them.